Hey campers, welcome back to Fun and Games Week. Tonight's top story, Burke is still missing. He was last seen trying to wrestle bears. Let's try again to undisappear him. Wait, what? Oh, hey Nat. Sorry, I'm really not good at this magic thing. Uh, th this isn't gonna work, Paloma. I'm operating a camera and writing down time code. I mean, this shot is terrible. Yeah, I guess that's what happened when you take a shot in the dark. Yeah, sorry, this isn't gonna work. Okay, I'll send you back. Well, I'll have to figure something out, campers. We're gonna head out to Arvind Gupta, who's gonna show us some really cool climbing toys. This is a very beautiful climbing butterfly. For making this, you require some card sheet, two refills, glue, thread, and an ice cream stick. Take a doubled up butterfly made from card sheet and apply glue. And on this, you stick a very colorful painted butterfly. After it dries up, reverse it and apply glue on the back side of the colored butterfly. And once the glue dries up, take two empty ball pin refills and stick them at a slot and then stick the other butterfly on top of it. You have now two refills which are sandwiched at a slant between two card sheet butterflies. The extra refills which are popping out can now be cut with the scissors. Now you have this butterfly. At the back of it you can see that there are two refills at a slant. Take an ice cream stick and make six notches, two in the middle and two on the ends. Then take a needle with about 2 meters of thread and weave it in this fashion. Take it out from one refill and weave it then to the next refill. At the ends of both the threads, you can tie two small beads. Now these beads will be the handles which you pull up to make the butterfly climb. Now the two other ends of the thread can be tied to the two ends of the ice cream stick. Now your climbing butterfly is almost ready. You've got to take the middle loop in the ice cream stick and hang it by a nail and then pull both the handles alternately and the butterfly will clamber up. Once you release it, by its own weight it comes down. If you pull both the handles, it climbs up. If you release it, by its own weight it comes down. It's a very beautiful butterfly indeed. Well, the climbing man is one of the most delightful paper toys. You need a long strip of paper, 28 centimeters long, 6 centimeters wide. Fold this long strip first into half and then into a quarter. Open the strip and on the fold make two small triangles like a small roof. Now lift the right triangle. Open it up and squash it inside, tuck it inside. Repeat the same with the left triangle. Lift it up and squash it inside. Now you will see a kind of an arrow kind of shape. Now you fold this so that you can see two strips, independent strips below and a triangle on the top. Now draw a line and cut a big triangle as shown. On this triangular portion, using a sketch pen, draw two eyes and a happy face. Now you take this triangular face and you tuck it between the two long strips, which are like the channels. And now you gently move these strips alternately and you'll be surprised that the face climbs and gets ejected. See this again. Extremely delightful toy. Thanks, Arvind. Those are some really cool toys. I can't wait to see what our campers do with them. And campers, you could take these toys and maybe add them to your carnival game for the end of the week. I want you to create a carnival game all your own and play it with your friends. You can record a video and then upload it onto the community page. At the end of the week, we're going to have them in the showcase. We'll show some of the best ones and give out prizes. I can't wait to see what you do with it. Bye, campers!
campers, we've certainly done a lot for only having half the week through. You've made so much cool stuff. I too would like to make cool stuff, like I always do. Oh, Burke, I bet you haven't even made your project today. Of course not. I don't even have hands. Well, isn't that convenient? No, the opposite in fact. Have you done yours? Yeah, duh. I made you. You just left a face on Sandra's automata. That doesn't count. At least it's making. It's really hard to get inspired. Yeah, it can be hard to get inspired. But you just gotta keep trying and you'll make something amazing. Thanks, Burke. This new you is super encouraging. Never change, ever. What about you, campers? Maybe seeing your awesome projects will help me get inspired. Let's see what you did with yesterday's projects. Wow, campers, I can feel your inspiration seeping into my bones. I don't have functional eyes, and even I can see that you are amazing. Remember to keep posting on the Maker Camp community page, and maybe you can become internet famous and create an Instagram account exclusively dedicated to your pets. Also on the community page, you can leave your questions and comments for me, Paloma, a person who can expertly throw her voice. See you look. Also use the hashtag MakerCamp on Twitter, Instagram, G+, The Digestic Duck, Tom Morrow, R2D2, me. See you tomorrow, campers!